Last year, I very confidently told you that the Dutch Prime by LPD Pedals is going to be the pedal of the year, the overdrive of the year, but I also said the pedal of the year. You can see on the back, it has Velcro, you know where it goes. Now, a lot of people said they couldn't really find it afterwards because they all sold out. It was a limited run and they all sold out and they kept appearing and reappearing on reverb. <laughs> Ladies and people, Today we look at the new Dutch. What is up YouTube? My name is Buddy Blues and it's Small Business Tuesday on a Tuesday, all right now. It's important that we keep bringing this one back, the Dutch Prime. It's important to bring it back because, let me talk about this for a second. I'll show you a video here if you haven't seen it. The Dutch Prime is apparently two Dutches, right? And it's it's a level drive trouble bass type thing. I don't know if it's based on it to me. I don't know if it's, but it's got everything you really want. It's got the tube screamer thing down. It's got the clon thing down. It's got the Timmy thing down. You can tailor this so much. And I fell in love with it and I still use it. I mean, it's look how dusty and dirty it is. It's just, I'm constantly being clicked with my feet and stuff like that. Again, it's a perfect overdrive and I've always said that. This has two where you could set the other one a little bit hotter and stuff like that. And that's what people usually did. Now with the new one, <laughs> now you've got two foot switches, same thing, level, drive, treble, bass. And what he added here is a high and low switch. What the high low switch does essentially is how I used it and how many other people use the other one. One at very high gain or um, not really, one at high-ish gain and one at normal gain. Now you've got that in just a button where you click the high low and just boosts it into another gain stage. It gets more gainy. I am in love with this thing for many reasons because it's got, like I said earlier, every aspect of every overdrive. I don't know how he managed to capture all of that. It does something in the mids that's beautiful. A clon, I love clons. A clon is too midsy. I like mids, not a lot of people do. This is if you hate clons, you would love this. If you love clons, you would love this. If you hate tube screamers, you'd love this. If you love tube screamers, you'd love this. And it's not a clone of either of these things. And if you love a Timmy and everything gets good about a Timmy, it's got it in here. And if you bring back the bass a little bit and you push the treble a touch, you can even get into like blues breaker territory. 
This does it all. If you can't tell yet by the amount of videos I've done for LPD, I'm a huge fan of LPD pedals. Look at that blue color now, and then we'll play some more. Top loaded jacks, nine volt, but it also goes to 18. I don't care about the top loaded. Uh, it could be side, I don't care, I don't care. I know a lot of people do, and a lot of people prefer top loaded. I couldn't care less. I'll make, a, I'll make space if the thing is worth the space. You know what I'm saying? This thing is a single coil dream, so I think I wanna play the white LSL Satakoi. And if you're nice enough to me, maybe I'll bring in the Frank Brothers as well. We'll play two guitars during the playing part, <laughs> if you know what I mean. We played humbuckers at the beginning. Uh, Siltone Oxbox, let's get to it.
Triple Dutch. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, you have now heard the new Dutch from LPD. I love how he's doing this now, man. I, he's really adding a little bit more color. I mean, don't get me wrong. I love this color scheme. It was, it was iconic. But he's adding a lot of colors these days. We saw the Coco Pelli not too long ago. He's adding a lot of colors and his petals really stand out. Does that matter because it's blue? Does it matter? I know it doesn't. I know it doesn't change the sound, but... I, maybe you'll agree, maybe you won't, maybe you'll fight me, maybe you'll fist fight me, I'm ready, <laughs> I was raised on the streets of Beirut, you know what I mean, <laughs> but I, when I look down at a pedal board, when I make my pedal board, I like to make it nice, I enjoy these things, I enjoy a good looking pedal board, I don't like the, you know, the crooked pedal board and stuff like that, maybe I'm anal, maybe I'm just an imbecile, <laughs> but that stands out, now, tonally, it also stands out, because it's going to replace a lot of stuff for you, this could easily replace two or three overdrives with the amount of gain that you can have with one foot switch. I like that quite a bit. This was your first mob this Tuesday, welcome. <laughs> if it's not, welcome back. Lawrence Petros, L the LP of LPD, is a one-man shop. It's a one-man operation. That's, a, that's the small business galore. So we'd like to give these people a voice because not a lot of them have the amount of money to make an entire marketing department ran by Janice. You know what I'm saying? If you're in the market for an overdrive, this could be a very good contender for you. Thanks so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this video, please uh, like, share, subscribe. We say it in every video. I, I hate myself every time I say it, but you really don't know how much it helps the channel. If you like the video, share it stuff like that it helps the algorithm and it helps it get more views and more views means that the video will be seen by more people <laughs> am i gonna sit here and explain math to you and how the algorithm works on youtube you think i understand it i don't ladies and gentlemen i'm, 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 I'm through up to uh, halfway through a two-week notice at my job if you know what i mean just trying to make do here <laughs> again thank you so much for joining me i have been buddy blues you have been the people of the blues until next time thank you for watching